I just come to do a quick review. I got today. I got a party light order from my party last week, and um, the first few items are all mine. And I got uh, a qualifying party, so I got a half price item. I got a host credit, and I bought a host offer at uh, less than the normal prices, obviously, because they're on the special sheets for the month. Um, I got in the box, I also got a free gift from Party Light for having the party, and that was a box of tea lights. So that's not to be sniffed at. They're about £8.95, and I got them in the scent Bewitched, which I think was a Halloween scent, so I missed that one. So I'm really pleased to have got these. It's the Clear Cups. Mm, it's lovely. It's got a I can smell a bit of like an aniseedy scent. It's, it's nice, it's sweet, it's lovely that. So that's uh, the one that got free. Uh, I also bought myself some tea lights in Woodland Path. And these are really nice. It's got a, a slightly sweet scent, but it's more like a foresty, crunchy leaf, ferny type. It's, it's a really nice scent actually. So I've got, I've got 12 of those. So I've got a few tea lights to be going on with. One of the um, guest offers for the month was two of the three wick candles. And I loved these and I, 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 I tasted, I didn't taste at all. I smelt the testers and I chose the two scents obviously that I liked. Well, I liked quite a few, but I could only buy two. Um, and I wanted the ones with the more elaborate coloured jars. Uh, just purely for the fact that they were more colourful, but that doesn't make sense when they're not the scents that you like the most. So anyway, I got the, the same jar, nice snap-on lid, which acts as a snuffer. And this is also in Woodland Path. It's it's a nice jar, it's fine. And I love these party light candles because they burn to the bottom. You don't get any waste and you don't get any soot. I burn lots of different candles and quite a lot of them do give soot even um, the more expensive Yankee brand gives soot. Uh, I've had a, a Goose Creek one that gives soot. Uh, quite a lot do, but but these don't seem to. I've never had a problem with those. They are on the more expensive side. They are thirty four fifty, and that's on offer two for thirty four fifty. Normally they're twenty two ninety five. So this was a really good buy. So I got one of those. Uh, so I have got another one, another three wick. And I got this one in the Moonlight, the Clair de Lune. Uh, and I had to smell it because Clair de Lune reminds me of the film Twilight. Uh, and I did actually like it. So it's Moonlit, Moon, not Moonlit, Moonlight, this one. And again, it's one of the planar jars, same jar. And it's a lot lighter than... The crayon, that, the scented crayon things that the lady had with her. But I can smell it. It is a lovely, really nice scent. I'm going to put this one in my bedroom. It's really lovely, that. I wish I'd got tea lights in that one as well. So that's the um, two, three wicks that I got. As my half price item, I picked the Holiday Garland uh, jar holder. And to me, this is not very you know, too holiday-ish to not use at any other time of the year. And this full price was 14 95 And I thought it was much better value, A, because I bought it for half price, and B, because unlike the other ones that were two for 20, they were like stands that you, you could stand your, it had a stand with legs, and then you got to pick a sleeve. Uh, but they weren't as nice as this. Um, I didn't think. Anyway, I can use this two ways and I either just put the jar on or I can pop over the sleeve. So I thought that was really nice. It's nice, bright, silver, shiny and uh, I'm very pleased I got that. I really, really like that. Um, so that's that. Uh, I'll just pop it there so I don't smash them. The next thing I got was uh, one of the whole stoppers for the month. And this really was a good buy. You got a glow light candle. This is the one that I chose in Ice Snowberries. And it's a really strong um, berry smell. And it's, it's really nice. 
really nice and it's it's very it's not just berries you can it is it's like it's iced with something it has a really like a frosted a frosty berry smell and it's really nice so i got that one and if you don't know about these these are the ones that you light them at the top and the whole candle lights up but not only did i get that i also got the offer was you bought this color changing plate and you got a free glow light so for 12.95 i got the color changing plate and the glow light candle which is worth 20 20 pounds now this is the color changing candle but i don't actually know how you're supposed to charge it oh that's something that i didn't realize i thought it came with um a usb lead and it actually doesn't it actually comes and it's three batteries so I'll quickly pop and see if i've got some batteries and a half so i can show it to you working now i want three the same right let's have a look that really surprised me actually because i was convinced that it was a usb for some reason but that's okay that's the battery falling on the floor Seem to want to go in from that one. And I've got this one. Does it have an on off switch? Just let me pop these in. Right, so, oh yes. So the batteries are in, and there is a little on off switch here. You're really not going to be able to see that. I'm... It is changing colour. That's actually bright red. Maybe it'll work better if I put the candle on. If I turn the light out. There, you'll be able to see that better. Now look at that and it glows. The whole, the whole candle lights up. And when it's lit, that'll be wonderful. I could also maybe... Oh, maybe you could put the sleeve on top because the sleeve is a little bit bigger, but you could put it on if you wanted to. That's really nice. I really like that. It's very pretty. Yeah, I'm quite pleased with that. So that's the uh, glow light and that was the offer. So free candle <coughs> and a colour changing plate for 12.95 ordinarily this you just pay 12.95 for this you could put anything like you put a bottle of wine we were discussing what you could use this for so you could put quite a few things on it you could put tea light candles on it i suppose in a little jar anyway that's uh the glow light candle you know what else did i get oh yeah so that's all of my purchases um and the rest of my guests some of them got different candles different three wick candles the only things other things i have to have to hand now these also were an offer it's the party light melts and my guest chose to get those those were on a guest offer uh three packs for 19 pounds 50 and i think ordinarily they are about nine pounds 50 each so this one is in silver birch bark which is one of the scents that i liked uh, and I will probably buy it the next party at the end of the month. It's nice, yeah. It's very men's aftershavey smell, that. And it is nice. And they have... One, two, three, four. So they have nine pieces all together. So that's that one. I'd probably buy a candle in it. Uh, the next one was Woodland Path, which was smelt. Uh, Red Apple Orchard. It is very apple -y. It's really nice. It's a very fresh apple scent. Sparkling Amethyst. This is another one that I like that I'll probably get in a three wick. Oh, they're a little bit awkward to get off these. 
Well, that other one was okay. Ah! Right. Yeah, I like that too. That's a really nice one. So that was Sparkling Amethyst. And Bamboo Waters. It's another one that I liked, but wasn't one of my favourites. Mmm, it's a very... It's a very fresh scent. I do like it, but there are others that I would buy over that. It's more like a fresh, freshy home type, you've just cleaned up type of smell. Um, the last one was Blackcurrant Cassis. And I'm not usually a berry sort of person, but the Ice Snowberries was really nice. And I, ha I didn't smell this one because I only go for scents that I think I'm going to like. I should really smell them all. And that actually is really nice. And I am not a lover of berry scents. And that, it's just, it's not too strong. I really quite like that. So that just shows you to smell the ones that you don't think that you're going to like. So that was set uh, them. So that a lot of my guests chose to buy the offer. Uh, and I'm looking forward to going to the next party because there'll be different offers, obviously, because this will be a November party. Uh, and I'm really pleased to have had one of these parties. I haven't had one for quite a number of years. And I'm, I'm very impressed that I've been able to get hold of a rep and get my three wick candles. So I shall uh, be burning this one, I think, first, Woodland Path. Uh, if I get anything new or uh, just pick, pick any different scents, I'll do another review at the end of the month. Hope that uh, inspires you to go to a party like party, even if you just bought some tea lights. They are worth buying. Uh, so hope to see you soon. Thanks for watching.